Thank you for that choir, uh, the Chanticleer Choir, and welcome to Focus on Crestview. I'm Marian McBride with Okaloosa Title and Abstract, and I have the honor and the privilege of introducing you to two of the people from First NBC Bank, Miss mm -hmm. Penny Hartsaw uh -huh. and Mr. Dale Rice. Hello, hello. Hello. And thank you for being our breakfast sponsor Thanks this for having month. us again. Wow. Yes, and have. the choir. Penny. I'm in it beautiful. Yes. I, I, I just do not know how Kevin Lusk, who I call the choir director extraordinaire <laughs> at Crestview High School. Every year he does such a fantastic job and it's better than the year before. I don't know how he does it, but he does. We've got and a talented group of people, of young students. He does a great we? job and those kids oh, they're just perfect. do awesome. He just, he just knows how to get the best out of and them. And y'all are our breakfast sponsor, yes, but y'all have Y'all have the choir come in to our breakfast, and it's a very, very special time. Is what about a Santa? Yeah. Oh. Well, you know what? We've we've have been doing this for how many years, Dale? Long time. A long time. And we just love coming in um, in December, getting the holiday spirit, getting the season started off right, and beginning the the month of December with such a beautiful choral selection. Crestview and High School community. is so good. We just get everything kicked off right. Yeah. So we're excited Perfect. about it. And this is a new opportunity for a new bank I to was sponsor. Say, I want to talk yeah. about this. It's yeah. first NBC Bank. Yeah. So Dale, you tell me, uh, you tell me you have been at the bank, but then it changed. Uh -huh. We'll get to that in a minute. But what do you do at the bank, Dale? Well, I, I'm in the commercial lending. Okay. Um, and you know, Penny and I have worked together for over 26 years. Yeah. Oh, yeah. well, they told me earlier, y'all, that they were like sister and brother, but they don't have the family fight, which is good. Well, the neat part yeah. is we started when we were 15. Yeah, that's it. Working together. Absolutely. So, um, of course you did. But anyway, but, but anyway, uh, you know, it's 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 really a, a a pleasure for us to be able to do this every year. I mean, we've been doing it together for a long time. And everybody looks forward to this breakfast. Yeah. It'll be packed, I'm yeah, sure. Yeah, the, the neat part about 
you know, First NBC is it's so much like we were, you know, at First National Bank of Crestview. Right. And, you know, it's just been a great year for us. Uh, they really love the customer. Um, mm. They love the employee. And, you know, they want us to continue to offer a world-class service. And it's just really been, you know, exciting for us to be involved. And, wow. and now they were really happy and excited about sponsoring the breakfast, just like we've done for how many years? Yeah, for, oh gosh, they 18 have, years. They seem to be yeah. very, and of course, the Chamber of uh, Commerce just loves y'all anyway, yeah. you know, and just loves all Well, they're so community-oriented, and I think First NBC Bank ha has all the, the positive aspects that we like in hometown banking. Right. Uh, we're still community-oriented. Uh, we still, but we have so many more things to offer our customers. Well, let's now. talk about that. But I want to ask you about the name. Yeah. And where does it? Where? Do, uh, where's the home? Mm -hmm. And how did all that come about? Well, Whatever you want to share. Mm -hmm. They they actually put the the bank together as a legacy bank. Uh, brought okay. a lot of the employees back that were at the bank originally before it sold, and then they started a new bank and and called it First NBC Bank. And it started in 2006 with oh. zero deposits, and now they're over a four billion dollar bank. Are they out of uh, uh, out of New Orleans? New Orleans. Out of New Orleans. Uh -huh. Yeah, okay. and most of the locations are in New Orleans. This was the first venture for First NBC into the Florida Panhandle. There are plans to expand even more, but right now we have three locations in Crestview, and we're the only bank in and town with three locations. There you to go. Serve but you. you were telling me on the uh -huh. phone earlier uh -huh. that you have the the Central is uh -huh. the one up there uh -huh. on Industrial. It's 85. across from Crestview High School, next okay. door to the post office. Okay. It's the big three-story building that has been completely redecorated and redone and we're so, so proud of it. See their bank. Everything from the parking <laughs> lot to the new sign know, to the, the flowers to uh, it's just so beautiful mm. and it's such a pleasure to come to come to work every day and we're all decorated for Christmas. We invite everybody to come in and see mm. how beautifully decorated the bank so is. Seem, we also seem like have, a really good We also for have our view. downtown location okay. which is back behind where the old First uh, National Bank of Crestview uh, main office was. It's back behind there. It's seven the drive throughs. It's on Spring Street, okay. but it's directly behind the Buddy Bracking building. There's still seven uh, drive up lanes and two walk up windows, and we wow. do a lot of business there. You know, that one's oh, still you know, that's open. really convenient. It is. You're right. If you had to go get some money when you go to the tax office, that's sort of it. <laughs> it's it's, it's just a property real appraiser. <laughs> we stay Ooh. very busy there. The girls do a great job I there. We we have uh, uh, Nancy Hadley ha um, hand handles that along with Pam McClellan and they just do such a good job and we have Elaine Hill who comes in and helps for lunches over at the Southside location which is right in front of Big Lots. We have Kim Parsons who is our branch manager there, Angela Cox who is our assistant branch manager wow. and we have two fairly new Shelby Whiteley and Ebony Muldoon that are two fairly new tellers. So mm -hmm. we are, we, we just, from one end of town to the other, we so can serve the only one that has three? Absolutely, the well, only bank in town with three How locations. Yeah, That's and great. with plans, like I said, to expand even further into the panhandle. Oh. So we're looking forward to that. And so who is the um, president? The president, uh, oh, it's just an icon in the banking industry, is Mr. Ashton Ryan, Jr. And he has just made us feel, he, along with all of the employees, out of New Orleans have oh. made us feel so welcome and if you can imagine we were all in turmoil for a while yes. uh, they are uh, mr. Ryan made sure everyone had a job from the old bank that is wonderful <laughs> in addition to that to the kind of bank that we're working for they gave all of the employees their years of service <laughs> wow. Did you hear yeah, that? that? No. Uh, yeah, and I'm... I mean, 
I've got 18 uh, years with the bank, Mr. and it's Ryan. not even that okay. old. <laughs> so we're going to say hi to Mr. Ryan. Thank you so much. And my direct boss, the director of retail, uh, is uh, the senior vice president, Karen Ar Arcado, mm -hmm. who has just been wonderful. Everybody over in New Orleans, they get, have given Are us all this. Are y'all hooked electronically oh, yeah. to them? Oh, yeah. Okay. Training. Yeah. I mean, anytime you have a question, anytime you have a need for anything, they have all been so wonderful wonderful even though there may be two states between us yeah but <laughs> believe be me it is like they're right next door they're right they're there for us no matter what we need that is awesome so, i want y'all to stay uh -huh. but penny what's coming up next on oh, our show next we have selections from destiny, destiny. Uh -huh. so we are looking forward to that and i know they're going to make our christmas spirit shine right there here. you go well, uh -huh. y'all the audience stay right here with us and we're going to be right back. Thank you. commitment to the community is something that we believe in and act on every single day. It's a key part of our culture and who we are as a company. Cox donates millions of dollars in cash and in-kind services to support local nonprofit and civic organizations each year. We recognize that a healthy community is a growing community. Here's a look at just a few of the organizations we support right here in Northwest Florida. We're extremely proud of all these local partnerships. Together we are working to make the Gulf Coast thrive. Someone will be in need, in need of wisdom, in need of comfort, in need 
of a friend, a brother, a sister, a meal. We should use the time we have to be heroes and make a greater impact by strengthening our ties to others. Be someone's hero. Give, advocate, volunteer, and night away. Welcome back to Focus on Crestview. I am Dawn Mann with Legacy Insurance, and I would like to um, say a great big thank you to Crestview High School Show Choir um, for the wonderful performances today for our show. Um, I am back here with Penny Hartzog and Dale mm -hmm. Rice mm -hmm. of First NBC Bank, yes. um, our breakfast sponsor for December. And I am so thankful for y'all's continued support oh, for our community too. and for the chamber. You just have no idea. We are so thrilled to be able to continue this great tradition. So, well, yeah. Well, what I want to know is um, what are some of your past and current positions that you have held actually with the Chamber of Commerce? We'll start with you, Penny. Well, back in 19, um, I was <laughs> the president of the chamber. Uh, in fact, several, I uh, held several uh, offices with the chamber uh, back, I think it was like 96 when I was 10. Mm -hmm. But um, <laughs> but we we have always been involved with the chamber. Uh, you know, fortunately, most of the financial institutions do come in. They do uh, help with the chamber and sponsor breakfasts and you know it's it's part of the anchor part to me the financial institutions for the chamber. I know off the top of my head when I came in in 2000, 99, 2000 I can name Mac, Ambassador, 
government issues, uh -huh. MC, um, <laughs> very active, very yeah, active, yeah. and um, very yeah. good mentor for me yeah. um, to follow in the footsteps of Penny Hartson. Oh, bless your so, heart. Um, well, thank yeah. you so yeah. much. Yeah. Yeah. Thank what about you, you so Dale? Much. Yeah. Well, I, I have served in many roles with the chamber. I was on the board for a lot of years and um, chaired the sports committee and also um, I was chair of the MAC committee for a couple of years. And um, I'm excited about being back on the board uh, with, uh, with the new chamber and excited about that. And again, that's something that our bank really promotes. They want us to be involved in the community, uh, not just saying that we're in a club or in the organization. They want us leading in it and being visible and accessible and able to respond. And that's, that's kind of what we've always done and we're that's excited so about it. So I love yeah. doing it. Yeah. Well, I am personally thankful for that. Yeah. I just, um, I love having your spirit around, um, you know, and I hope to see you at more breakfast. Yeah. You know, I love that smiling face. <laughs> well, so, thank um, you so much. But I want to roll into some yeah. bank products. What's some, yeah. Um, what's some yeah, we are so thankful to, um, to, of course, be employed by First NBC Bank, uh, along with all of the complete renovation uh, between the building and the parking lot and um, our continuing to keep our other two locations. We have such improved products and so many more products to offer uh, all of our customers uh, past, present, and future. So uh, for those of you that haven't had a chance to, to even call First NBC or come in and see us, and I don't know how you could have not because we've been so, so busy and we're so thankful for it, but everyone is so thrilled with the products we're able to, to offer. Great, great. So we are thrilled. And of course, Dale has, uh, heads up the lending part and I'm over in the retail part. So anything to do with retail, customer service, new accounts, tellers, any of that, just give us a call. Again, the Southside location opens new accounts. They're just as, as able to help you if it's more convenient on the south end of town and then the the downtown office is basically paying and receiving and they receiving. they don't do the actual new accounts or CDs or anything like that we have some terrific money market rates terrific uh, interest bearing accounts we offer uh, free checking it's called a free uh, respo first responders account phenomenal interest rates on those uh, if you have ever uh, been a, if we call it a first responder, it's teachers, uh, uh, medical, anything to do with medical, anything to do with the school board, anything to do with the military, wow. you know, a, a brand, a just absolutely free account with interest. So all kinds of firemen, anything What a way that, to give back. Yeah, because yeah. they give so much to us, we're giving back to them, yeah. so. What about you with your uh, commercial lending? I know you're excited about that. Well, I can tell you the neat part is we can look at a loan up to sixty million dollars. <laughs> yeah, wow! So, I mean, yeah, it, it is exciting, uh, you know, to work for a big bank that has a lot of products, and and we're really excited about the future in the in the Panhandle as they continue to grow in the Panhandle. Absolutely, Crowley absolutely. Band, yeah. I met um, um, the upper management people from New Orleans at our golf tournament when yeah. they came over. Yeah. And I truly enjoyed sitting and talking to them. What wonderful people. Oh, they are, every yeah. one of them. And we're so fortunate. We've got um, Ed Marshall coming in to the chamber breakfast. Uh, I want to introduce him to so many of the Crestview people. He's head of the public relations mm -hmm. and advertising. And so he's coming over for the breakfast. Oh, that's great. Yeah. That's that's Correct. what I'm Speaking saying. Speaking of around town, yeah. um, let's talk about some ribbon cuttings that are going yeah. on that we have for the month of December. Yeah, I'm looking at December the 4th. Be sure and mark your calendar. We have a brand new member at the Crestview Chamber, Yoga Junkie. Boy, that's sounding like something I need to get into. Uh, 12 noon, they're located at 2225 South Verdon. So be sure and show up there for the, the ribbon cutting for that. In addition, we have another ribbon cutting, uh, December the 15th, Gentiva Health Services. This again is at 12 noon and they're located at 370 West Redstone Avenue. 
Be sure and mark your calendars and show up for these ribbon cuts. And I know we have a business after hours yeah, coming up. Yeah, oh, yes. look who's uh, doing that. Uh, Thursday, <laughs> December the 10th. Uh, it's called the end of the season hurricane party. Business after hours at Legacy Insurance. Absolutely. Yeah. Uh, from 5 to 6.30. So Absolutely. come out and, and join the fun. We are going to have a toast at 6 o'clock to uh, end hurricane season. And it thank officially goodness, ends today. Yeah, and, and say so uh, one more year without being hit yes, by a hurricane. Yes. What wonderful, oh, just give thanks for that. Absolutely, yeah. we are so thankful for it. Yeah. Um, and our business spotlight member um, this month is Casbah Coffee Company. Oh, right. uh, they have moved to their new location. Um, they roast their own beans. They do a cold brew, which I have never seen beans um, pressed out of cold water to make. It's supposed to be uh, low acid and tastes really good. Wow. They, you know, they've got well, all I'm these a big coffee fan. Yes, I need to go need by to go their by new their lo location. Absolutely. They do open mic night, so I'm um, I'm excited for them in their new location um, yeah. on Pine What is Street. open mic night? Um, they have uh, people come in that sing with guitars. Don't do karaoke. <laughs> Karaoke? Yeah, I can I empty the place <laughs> real quick. <laughs> well, uh, we're going to wrap this up for the month of December, and we want to thank the um, Crestview um, High School Show Choir again and uh, First NBC Bank uh, for everything that they do for our community again. Thank you so much. Um, and um, wish everybody, everybody a, a Merry, Merry Christmas, Christmas and Happy New Year and Happy Holidays. Absolutely. Yeah.